Hello, 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 and welcome back to Don't Try This at Home. We are the Congenial Oxmists, and <coughs> oh dear, excuse me, we are back on my laptop actually. Um, so I'm now up to date on Quill's uh, series, Quill 18 series, so I'm up to episode 9 of that, which is up to date as of the time I'm recording this. Learned quite a lot of stuff on there, uh, particularly the power demand of the hydroponics. I didn't quite realise how much this takes up, so we are massively going to need to expand this. Um, and we really do need to uh, get some base defences set up. Uh, so I am going to have to take the hit and put some stonking great big walls up here. Um, it's been a few days since I've played now. So I'm just going to let it run just to jog my memory. Um, after the last episode I did leave it to run for a, a couple of uh, day, well, a couple of game days. Uh, just to let a few things settle down and I've got to admit and I do apologise I've completely forgotten what happened in those extra few days but um, I'll, I'll look back over the uh, episodes I recorded when I fire the desktop up um, I think we did a bit of trading because we got a, a bunch of cloth so some more carpets have gone down um, we got a few components as well uh, for the hydroponics which I want to select the shrooms on all of that. Um, have we got much steel? No, we've got none, pretty much, which is why this isn't being built, and more importantly, that's not being built, nor this one up here, uh, which is meaning we've got a breach in our defences. We've got a party. Jeanette is throwing a party. That is good news. So priority at the moment is going to be to find some steel. Now, let me just check. No one's restricted, no. Um, we've got some mining jobs set up. Oh, that was weird. weird. It just tabbed out. Um, mining jobs set up there for components. Oh, and we've got some mining set up here for steel. So, remind me who is our miner. Oh, we've got a few miners, but Alex is the key one, and Alex is there smashing through... Uh, some of this steel as we speak. Aura is on an Alchemy hole binge. Brilliant. The shop's awesome. I'm well chuffed that I found this feature that I didn't know before. Again, thanks to Quill for that. Um, so we are making a good amount of uh, steel here. And something that I thought we could potentially do is just set up a job for making sculptures out of, you know, we've got tons of, uh, of marble kicking about. Don't really care what the qualities are. Chin them off to the, uh, to the stockpile there, the shop, um, and, and just do it as a money-making exercise. So we'll be making money from, uh, from our alcohol and then from sculptures as well. Now, sculptures do take a while to make. That's the only downside to this. But say if I set up a job for sculptures and we'll say we'll do it out of marble or sandstone, I don't really care which, and we'll do until uh, we'll do until to say but say they need to be good quality or better so if we get some poor ones <coughs> they will get dumped off into the stockpile but they won't get counted so the idea being then any good ones we make will hopefully catch them install them before they get sold um, so my phone's going off let me put that on silent it's just tabbed out again which is really odd so we'll do that. Uh, now, does this stockpile take art? Yes, it does. So it will get chinned off to there anyway. I do like this sculpture. 930 beauty. Wow. How much is that one? 400. Oh, yeah, because this is excellent quality. 
as opposed to just good quality. Yikes! That that's pretty uh, pretty neat. Um, this superior double bed. Oh, I've already set it up to move up so there, so Alex can have it. And then Spiffy and Margot will then take this royal bed. Who's our constructor? It, it is Spiffy himself. So I'm going to get you to prioritise that. I didn't see what you were doing. But, oh well, too late. Uh, and then if I just pause, let's reinstall that somewhere a bit... Uh, more central and then I'm going to go set the owner so that's going to be Spiffy and Margot hopefully Margot will stop being a a pain and having a uh, an affair wants to sleep sleep with Spiffy oh was it not Margot who had the f who was who was in the affair Maybe that's... Oh. Oh, it was Margot. Opinion of my lo lover, Margot, but Spiffy's the one who's married. Alright, well, we'll see what happens there. Um, yeah. That's less than good. When Alex is up, we'll deconstruct, I think, that normal bed. What have we got here? Good. I'm good again, so yeah, we'll just decon... Oh, in fact, no, I might just move it up here. Uh, and then that bed will become Alex's. Who's our tailor? Aura. Who is currently resting. What's up with you? Po major plague and you're pissed. Okay. Uh... Margot, can you come and tend to Aura? Oh no, you can't. Already tended. Well, hopefully the plague doesn't wipe her out. Her out? Him out. Him out. Because that wouldn't be good. We've got steel coming in now, haven't we? So I'm going to put an urgent haul on that so it goes into a stockpile so then it can get used. In fact, I think it'll get used anyway, actually. It doesn't need to be in a stockpile. It just needs to be in a stockpile if you want to sell it. Yeah, we've got some chem fuel. That that was because I ballsed up in one of the trades and clicked chem fuel instead of components. Which was, uh, yeah, well. That's why you check things, folks. That's why you check things. Alex is still asleep. God, how much sleep do you need, fella? Frost file, you want a body part. Okay. You need a new eye. Well, that's going to be a new body part then, really, isn't it? Uh, so we're going to set deconstruct on that. Aura is really not well. In tons of pain. Develops an immunity. Yes! That is what we needed. That is absolutely what we need. I want to haul that into the shop. That was something someone left after they uh, had a good stay. So, hauling steel. No, come and deconstruct this. I want to get the bedroom squared away. Uh, so, if we reinstall this centrally. Oops. And then David, just go and do that while you're up. Cool. Right, now we can set this to Alex. So Alex should be a bit happier then. Because your bedroom's not great. But at least you've got a decent bed. And it's a barrack. Why is it classed as a barrack? shouldn't be a barrack. I'm missing a door? I've got a door. I'm confused. Seems a bit weird. Or is now chewing through all this uh, cotton, because we has millions. Um, but I'm going to keep growing it. Oh, oh no, is that blight? Oh, that is blight. 
Um, yeah, we need to chew through the uh, cotton, but we need to keep growing it because we've got loads of uh, carpet we need to make, which takes up loads of cloth. So, if you right-click on cut plants, you can cut all blighted, which is a new feature. So, that'll be good. No more to cut. At least that's now not going to spread, because it's. I think it's four tiles it can spread. I think. Yeah, there's no... Uh, there's no text on that, but uh, fire, but that's okay. Tortoise self-tamed, and a, and we've got that boom rat, of course. So the tortoise, I'm going to set you to obedience training. Not because I want you to be obedient, but simply because I want the uh, skill. Now, what are we doing on food? We don't actually have any cooked meals. That's not ideal. David, you need to get on that, my darling. David the female. So I'm going to drop your hauling down to a three. So you'll prioritise cooking. So you now not moaning about the Barrett? Uh, no, it wasn't you. It was Alex, wasn't it? Luxuriantly comfortable, feeling good, awful bedroom. Well, that'll help when we get the carpet down. Urgently hungry, yeah, you're going to go and get some food. In a little pain and insulted. So what are our relations looking like? Spiffy and Alex don't get on. They really don't get on. Oh, they had a social fight, didn't they? Hmm. Yeah, Nick so good. Disease, sensory mechanites. That sounds a bit severe. Uh, oh, I should have saved that bed and put it in here, shouldn't I? Right, we need hospital beds. Which we haven't unlocked. Are we doing any research? No, we're not. So I am going to go and smash out... In fact... Yeah, no, just smash out hospital beds. And then we can get some hospital beds set up. All that corn out of the way, which shouldn't be in there. Yeah, because we've got three people ill, but technically only two bed spaces, and I don't like it being double bed. Particularly if they're getting plague and stuff like that. It, it just doesn't sound right, does it? Unhappy nudity. Yeah, that's fairly legit. Aura should be on tailoring. What are you doing? You're having a fruit drink. That's good, because that will give you a bit of a buzz. You're quite hot. Yeah, it is hot in outside. 38 degrees. Um, you're smashing through this. Now we might, when that's clear, we might be able to get a better fishing pier. This was something like 61% or something. Something along those lines. Oh, it doesn't say no. There's four fish in there. We'll keep mining the steel because we need it. And we have beavers! So let's double click that and hit hunt. Have we got a hunter? Yes we do, although not particularly high priority but that's okay. We've got bandages, that's good to see. We haven't got any medicine. We do need to research medicine then, don't we? Uh, so I will queue up medicine production. And we do have someone set to do the researching. Or is again chewing through some cloth. Want that holding out of the way. Yeah, so get yourself through all this uh, cotton. Be nice, uh, forget what it is. There is a, a 
planks we can get that's a buff. Is it tools cabinet or something? Which will speed that up. Uh, so, alright, you're now going on to making apparel. So maybe... Taylor apparel, tinker apparel, weaver a loom. I'm going to drop that down to a three. In fact, no I'm not. I'm going to leave them at twos and I'm going to weave at loom as a one priority and just keep an eye on it because that can mess up sleep and stuff. Although they should still do it. Alex is getting pretty damn good at this, aren't you? Look at that. You're absolutely nailing it. And I'm still getting lag spikes even on my laptop. That's really weird. My laptop's a lot better than my desktop. Not because my desktop's pants, this is, uh, I think I've said it before in another video, this is actually my works laptop, naughty, I know, I know. Um, but I use it for computer modelling and simulation, so, which is effectively what a computer game is. So, by its very nature, being good at modelling and simulation, it is therefore very good at gaming, so it's pretty much a gaming spec laptop. Let's go and set them to some shrooms, which weirdly need light. I don't know why mushrooms need light, because in the real world they don't. So they don't photosynthesise, but, uh, okay. Whatever, the game will do what the game will do. Cut all blighted, phone no blighted. That's good. I want to haul all this in before it spoils. Cotton I'm less bothered about because we've got loads. And we've got some shrooms. Not the magic ones. I've set up this little uh, thing at the back which I've divvied up and that's not central is it? That's going to bug the crumbs out of me. Uh, but this will be for the uh, the light mushrooms. The, what are they called? I forget what they're called. Is it a Ragalux or something like that? Baby, uh, Igaralux. Igaralux? The lighty mushrooms, the lighty uppy ones. So Aura's now smashing through this and creating loads of cloth. Excellent. Get these carpets down. I want to build more beds in the hospital, but I'm not going to do that until... Um, we've researched hospital beds I, I, I don't see a point in um, doing it twice so we can set up some art in here that'll be good and in the guest room it's not going to be even that's Possibly going to bug me a touch. Uh, that wall needs smoothing. As does that one. Any other smoothing jobs? No. And then we can art up that room. And then we've got a spare room, which is good. Or uh, how are you feeling? Pleasant environment, feeling bad sick. Yeah. You've still got these... Uh, You've got an immunity, so that'll go. You've got an alcohol tolerance, which isn't ideal. So we have meat and we have veg. So in theory we can make some meals. We do actually have grilled veg there. And David's now out making stir-fry by the looks of it. Yep, some stir-fry. Which is frozen, so it won't spoil. And ironically, they don't need to thaw it before they uh, eat it, which is quite funny. Uh, there's some more steel there to be had. We're good on steel now, but we've still got quite a bit queued up. So what's our next play? I think our next play is setting up base defences, but I don't want to queue up more stuff, more construction stuff should I say, until we have got through what we're currently doing. It'd be nice to have some lights in the corridors. I think I might do that. 
Although power's not great at the moment, though, is it? So let's put some lights down. Well, there and there. It's going to use more steel, of course. And we'll see how much that lights it up. We'll probably need some more here, actually. So I'll put one in the corner there. We have some visitors who have some tradey stuff. Who's our trader? It's Ben Jamin. Who's currently having a snooze. It's alright. They've already been in and done some shopping. That's good. Hoping they buy these hops. They last a while, which is good. Uh, so Ben, come and trade. What can we trade? What can we get rid of that we don't want? So basically force them to buy it, which is quite amusing. Um, do I want to get rid of the clothes or the booze? I haven't got a lot of money. And they haven't really got a lot that we can buy. I'll take your component. I'll take your medicine, though. And let's sell them. That's going to be all these clothes, isn't it? Oh, but you... Uh, you can't afford it. Uh, 85, so that gives us another 6 to play with. Which are probably not going to do. I could buy your survival meals. I mean, it's a bit of a waste of dollar, but at least it means we can get rid of some more stuff. Uh, but not all of it. 23. 85. Well, that'll do, I think. Uh, yeah, that'll do. Um, and we will set an urgent haul on those, because the animal's already eaten one of those. Yeah. Um, num, 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 num. There was something else I was going to look at, and I've just completely forgotten what it was. Huh. Keep setting mushrooms on here. No, I've completely forgotten what it was. Unhappy nudity heat wave. Is not good. Particularly when we haven't got that cooler set up there. And we haven't got a cooler in here in the bedrooms actually. So these might get a little bit toasty. So to that end, I am going to set a mine job up here, yes here, and then we'll put a cooler in there. These two are off because we've got a gap, although we now have doors there so I can turn them on. Not that we're going to need it in the heat wave, of course. But I mean, power is actually looking all right, despite the fact that we've got solar panel out. Um, we've still got a few of these hydroponics to build, and you've already absolutely nailed it through there. So let's get a cooler set up as a priority. It's going to get warm in this heat wave. This is cold, so all that's cold. That's okay. And that single cooler seems to be doing quite a good job of these four rooms it's doing. The freezer is still frozen. We've got loads of cloth. So, do we want to set up some more constructing things? No one's got the passion for it except for Spiffy. Which is a shame. So Spiffy's just going to be going mad. You're naked as well, which really doesn't happy ha make me happy. And so is Benjamin. Oh no, are you wearing something? You haven't got a t-shirt on. And you're not a nudist, but you're not bothered at the moment. Hmm.
that's normal quality. I might change the priority here then. So let's have a look. So they can wear anything that's normal and above 75. Well, let's drop that down to a 70. So then at least they can then wear this shirt, whoever gets to it first. Benjamin or Spiffy, I would have thought. Oh, it's David who's gone and got it. And then Alex picks up. <laughs> All right, fine. So yeah, we need we need some shirts. Button down shirt. What are you making out of everything? But you've got that not as a high priority. We've got you doing the uh, working at the loom first. Which uh, I see. I don't know. Don't like them if they're unhappy nudity. That's it gets you a big debuff. But equally, I want to get these carpets down for the beauty. Because that also gives you a debuff. So, you know, trade one priority for another. Now, that's not got power. Why? Surely that can reach. Uh, that's not what I was looking for. It's Huh. Maybe it can't reach then. So let's just run a cable through the wall a little. Which means we're going to have to do it on the other side as well. With all things being symmetric. Spiffy, building cooler. That's now built. And we're now out of steel again. So mine that steel out. Is that steel? Yes it is. So I'll mine that out. We've got a manhunter pack. Let's just keep looking for steel just for the moment. That's sandstone there, some steel. So I'll set that up to be mined. Is that steel? No, that's sandstone. Looks similar. Ay 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 ay. Yeah, we'll have to hope, really, that we maybe uncover some when we open that mining up, which is a plan at the moment. Manhunter of Huskies, alright, nicked so good. hide over here a touch so when they get round we haven't really, yeah we need sandbags up but again you need steel for that and we're not going to outrun them David's down oh this isn't going well come on Flip. Now who are our incapable of fighting? Thankfully none of the two guys are still up. Can we try and outrun them? Oh flipping heck, this is a bit brutal. Might get you to try and run inside. In fact no, that's not gonna work. Come on, point blank range. Go on. Yes, we're up. Right, Aura, you're gonna have to haul everyone in. And we haven't got the hospital beds. That has really not gone well. Come on, rescue all these dudes. I know you're ill yourself, but the fate of the colony relies upon you now. You stacking them on top? <laughs> That's hilarious. You stacking them on top of each other. <laughs> oh, that husky's up, but you're no longer a manhunter, so that 
not the end of the world. So I'll actually set you to tame. Can you doctor? Oh cripes, no you can't. That's less than good. Oh dear, I don't I think people are gonna die here. Minor blood loss might be alright. Moderate's not good. Mod You're up and about. Minor Severe. So Margot and Jeanette need looking after. Sorry David, you, you're going to have to get up. Margot and Jeanette. Oh shoot, and now David's down. Or, sorry, you're going to have to get up, mate. Oh, no. Oh, and Benjamin's down in a freezer. Come and rescue him. Otherwise he properly will die. You can't tend. Or is the only one who's up at the moment. Oh, of course we've got an infection. Oh no. This could end really badly. Do some rescue in here then. So at least people are in their own beds. Oh, Margot's died. Damn, she was our researcher. Why's the cat gone mental? Where's the cat gone nuts? Wow. And we've now lost Jeanette. <laughs> and Spiffy. This is not going to plan. No one is actually conscious. Come on, someone come round. Extreme blood loss, well you're dead. Extreme, extreme. Extreme. Oh, I think we might be stuffed here, boys and girls. I think we might be stuffed. I think we really are. Lost another one. We've got visitors. They might come and help. Oh, please come and help. down to two we're down to one oh and we're dead well that was short lived wasn't it I was quite enjoying this so I think I might be naughty and go back to a save just so we can keep the series going a bit but uh, that is naughty to do but we'll make that decision next time until then, thanks for watching.